Experts say blocking Qatar Airways in Australia could cost its economy millions. Good news for globetrotters as Uzbekistan opens up to Qataris. Qatar is set to provide medical support for Palestinian athletes living under occupation. And in sports, Qatar's Al Rayyan and Al Shamal are set to play in the West Asia Super League. Hi, it's Fatma, and you're watching the Roundup. Here are today's top stories from Qatar. Blocking Qatar Airways from adding extra flights to Australia will cost the country's economy more than $500 million a year in tourism revenue. The warning was made by industry leaders who pointed to a cost ranging between $540 million and $788 million annually in incremental economic activity that's based on approximately 50% of the seats being sold to overseas visitors. The debate in Australia was sparked earlier this month when Qatar Airways was denied a request to add additional flights to the country to help with rising demand. Now, the industry experts also say the decision could harm Virgin Australia, which signed a strategic alliance with Qatar Airways to transport passengers from the Gulf carrier to domestic destinations within Australia. In more aviation news, Qatari passport holders can now enter Uzbekistan without a visa for a period of 30 days. The decision was announced months after an official meeting between Qatar's Emir Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani and the Uzbek president in Samarkand in June. In other news, Qatar is set to provide free medical service to Palestinian athletes living under Israeli occupation. Players of Palestinian national teams and clubs will receive free medical services through the Qatar-funded Hamad Hospital for Rehabilitation and Prosthetics in Gaza. Qatar inaugurated the facility in Gaza in 2019, establishing the first prosthetic hospital to open in the besieged Palestinian city. And finally, Qatar's Al Rayyan and Al Shamal have been allocated to groups A and B within the Gulf League as part of a recent draw for the second installment of the FIBA West Asia Super League basketball competition. Al Rayyan was drawn into Group A alongside Kuwait Club Club, Saudi's Jeddah Club and the Bahrain Club Muharraq. Al Shamal would face off against Manama, Shabab Al Ahli Dubai, and Kazma. That's it for me today. For more stories, head over to our website, dohanews.co, and make sure to download our app for your daily updates.